Hey, I'm here at Society, and what I want to show you is how to put the quilt binder on your Viking or Faf machine. And this is what comes in the box. First thing is you're going to have a stitch plate that um, gets anchored on, and it has a little indentation so that it'll fit right in the groove. And then we're going to go ahead and screw that one in. And that comes in the bag as well, in the box. Then we're going to take this scary looking contraption. And we're going to pull that out. And we're going to put this over here. And I'm going to put my washers on here like so. And then screw, the, oops, then screw this one in. And of course my fingers aren't working because you're watching me. And so this gives me a little play as to where I want um, the stitching to be. One more of those on there. And I think I got a, one screw left in the bag. I'm gonna come and put this on. On this particular binder, you are going to need to Cut your strips at one and three quarters. Um, I got the cutout on the back of the foot for the foff, so of course I can have my IDT down while I'm doing this. Then I need a pair of scissors. Stand by, Katie. Now we're gonna see if the sewing shop has a pair of scissors that actually cut fabric Oh my goodness, they do. I'm only saying that because the majority of the ones that people leave here, uh, you, you can't cut with them. So, I'm going to thread this tail around through here. I'm going to stick it through there. And then you can use something fancy to run that down through there. Like a coffee stirrer, toothpick, a stiletto tweezers and I just want to get that guy all the way down through come to me come to me all right I have the foot on and then I'm just going to put this back through here and you can see it's going to start turning it for me no effort at all and I should have put my fur fabric in right sides um, I can see now that I need to move it over this way a little bit more so my stitching is right on there. So, you need to make a ton of these in a hurry for masks. I'm telling you, this is the way to go. There's no ironing involved. There's no anything involved. Just run it right through there. And I do want to point out I could come over here on my stitches and go ahead and change that to a zigzag. And... That'll totally cover it if you didn't even want to do a straight stitching. It is simple as that. There you have the fastest mask straps ever. No elastic, no hair ties, no fuss.